What's up YouTube? It's Drag Bus Day. Hope everybody's having a good Thursday afternoon. I just got home from work. Had a package in the mail from eBay. I'm gonna share that. Also I dug a couple of sets out of the closet. Been doing some, they're kind of dusty. Been doing some uh, reorganizing and I uh, wish I could have these things on display but we're just strapped for room kind of so uh, plus I've got so much stuff out right now that it's anyway constantly getting a hard time about about how many cars I've got but um, several closets right now full of stuff and uh, stuff in storage and hopefully uh, we'll have more room soon got a couple of uh, projects in mind but anyway I'm gonna show the 2010 Toys R Us 20 car set Sweet Rides Delivery these are the ones that have the candy names on them Reese's Pieces um, Tootsie Pop all that different stuff uh, and then also I got out the 2010 30 car garage set which is uh, everybody's pretty much seen last year's garage set recently because it's been on sale on the website. It's been online. It's been it was at Walmart, you know, a few months ago, and uh, uh, on clearance. And so everybody's seen last year's garage set. It's a cool set. Uh, it was the last year of the garage series last year, uh, but uh, for 2011. And then of course we've had Boulevard this year, and then Boulevard next year. But uh, this was one of my favorite uh, series. You know, the first year, um, like, what, 08, we had just Larry's Garage, and uh, I've got a set that's got a, uh, I think it's got the passing, pink passing gasser from Toys R Us, I've got to dig that one out, and it came from Toys R Us, that was the first year that they just did Larry's Garage, then, this year, the following year, they did Larry, Wayne, and Phil's garage, and then last year they did it by, uh, everybody knows, car manufacturers, Ford, Chevy. Uh, I didn't buy that uh, GM versus Ford, or, you know, whatever it was, the 20 car set where they had the, the Fords and the Chevys or whatever up against each other. I didn't buy that set. I did get the uh, Walmart uh, garage set. But like I said, everybody's been seeing that one, so I thought I'd share this one. Let me share my uh, little eBay package real quick. Everybody knows that I like the uh, the Neo Classics a lot, right? A lot of people like those because they've got the old Redline style wheels on there, just like the original Redlines. Well, I also like. Along with those, I like the uh, black walls as well, older black walls, and I picked this one up not too long ago, the Teetotaler, so take the uh, black wall Teetotaler model and combine it with Neo Classics, you get a Neo Classic Teetotaler with uh, those red lines on it, looks really sharp. I picked this up for $6, um, if you'll search... If you're on eBay and you'll search completed uh, auctions, uh, it was a single, this was just a single car, teetotaler. The guy was in like Atlanta, uh, in Georgia, I think. He's a great seller. He shipped it in a box. Thank you so much. I need to, uh, if I haven't already given him some awesome feedback uh, since this came today, then I need to do that this afternoon. But I love this thing. He did uh, put in the listing. He was totally honest. It had a small ding on the corner up here. Doesn't show that much. Um, other than that, great condition. They only made 3,500. 3,500. 3, uh, of this bug, 10,000. It take 3,500. 10,000. Um, the Batmobile, 13,000. Still goes for 40, 50 bucks sometimes, but the uh, Ecto-1, 6530, 6530. Still almost double what they made of the T-Totler. Now we're getting a lot closer. This uh, T-1 drag bus, very limited piece. You had to subscribe last year to uh, to get that one, and uh, they shipped it out at the uh, 
at the end of the year with the metal case. They made uh, two, only 2,000 of these. Only 2,000. That's, uh, I think, the same number as the 2008 Christmas bus. The holiday Christmas bus. So, um, yeah, that, that one's pretty rare. But they only made 1,500 more of this one. So, I'm really glad that uh, I've got some other Neo Classics from the last couple of years that they've been running a lot lower production run. Uh, let's see, the Rocket by Baby, I think they did 6,000 of. That's a pretty good low number. This uh, Teetotaler, 3,500, that's extremely low. Uh, let's see, what's another one that has a low number? Pink 67 Camaro, 6,000. They did 6,000 of those. And uh, there's a couple of other ones at like 4,000. Uh, the uh, My Real Riders uh, Ambulance, I think they did 4,500. I'd have to look at them. I can't remember every one of them. I know that for a long time, they would do 10,000 or 11,000. Every single time, 10,000, 10,000, 11,000. Uh, and that's, that's almost... That's a lot, you know. You you go from ten thousand of these to just thirty five hundred of this one, and this one sold out. It says uh, Red Line Club on there. It's really cool. It's got some gold gas tanks with like a bronze or brown Spectre Flame color on there. Really nice, really nice. So anyway, that that was my eBay package today. Six bucks. Uh, the the guy's a really good eBay seller. If you look at completed uh, listings for the for this teetotaler, six dollars and fifty cents, I think you have to look look on there. And uh, let me show these uh, sets real quick. I just wanted to uh, mention production runs because they only did uh, thirty five hundred of that teetotaler, and thirty five hundred that's uh, that's pretty good. That's uh, that's not very many. Let's go ahead and look at this garage set. Now this is, uh, we'll start with Phil. Like I said, in this set we had uh, Phil's, Wayne's, and Larry's Garage. Uh, they did nine castings in this set, in this box set for Phil. Ten for Wayne, eleven for Larry. Add that up, that's thirty. I don't know why they didn't do ten, ten, ten. Maybe it's how long they've been there, or I don't know. Nine for Phil. 10 for Wayne, 11 for Larry. Let's go ahead and look at Phil's cars real quick. We got the uh, Barracuda down here in the bottom, really sharp. That was a club car in 2011, last year. Anyway, that was a RLC car. Then you got the Pro Mod Willys. Then you got the Chevelle. Then you got the Charger. That's a nice Charger. The Nova, that's a 66 Nova. The 8 crate, there's actually a cool 8 crate that I've got. I've got a bunch of chases on the blisters of these. If anybody's interested, I've got duplicates and triplicates. I got cases and cases of these through One Stop Diecast because I wanted to complete the set. I wanted every color variation of every car. I like this series a lot. It was my favorite year for the garage set. And so, uh, if anybody's looking for, uh, I've got the purple one of the 8 crate, uh, or not purple, blue and silver with uh, two of those in the Chase signature. I've got the Camaro, that's a nice 69 Camaro, I've got it in the Chase, uh, two different colors with uh, the initials on the bottom. And then I've got some of the drag trucks. They didn't put the drag truck in here for his exclusive, but they did put the uh, T1 drag bus. I had to have that one. And all these cars in here have the uh, initials on the bottom. Well, let's start with uh, Larry's Garage. Custom Beetle. 51 LeSabre Concept. Mach 1 Mustang. GTO Wagon. School Busted, Golden Submarine, pretty wild model. I like those wheels a lot. 34 Sedan Delivery, Ford Sedan. The Passion Woody, Purple Passion Woody. The Passing Gasser. 
And then this one was probably my favorite in this, uh, in uh, Larry's Garage, that 57 Chrysler 300. Man, that thing looks so good with those thick white walls on there. Big, meaty white walls. Looks really good. And then for Larry, you had the exclusive of the Bone Shaker in black. Pretty cool. Now let's move over to Wayne's Garage. You got the 71 El Camino. 57 Chevy. You got the shoe box. Oh, that's the one that I've got the uh, purple with the initials on it. Instead of the red there, it's uh, it's got purple on it. You got the fish and chipped. It's a neat model. It's based on uh, what a uh, Jaguar, right? Then we've got the uh, Lincoln, 64 Lincoln, stankin' Lincoln. Got the 70 Chevelle wagon, super sport wagon. The Very 8. Neat Streeter, Oops. Neat Streeter, and Street Rotter. Street Rotter's been around for a while. That's a really cool one. I also like the uh, red and the black. Uh, there's, like I said, there's several uh, colors of each car. Uh, Y'all probably all know that. I've got a couple of the blue uh, Mach 1 with initials on it. I've got a couple of the orange and yellow school busted. The green beetles. Anyway, I've got extras of most of these. Oh, I almost uh, missed Wayne's exclusive. It's the Rolling Thunder. So, uh, one exclusive uh, blister pack for each uh, designer. Pretty cool. And then the whole set all together. See if we can get most of it in one shot. It's a really nice set. And uh, so anyway... Like I said, I got that, uh, I think I paid 70, $79 on sale for that set. I usually wait till they go on sale. I also got this set on sale for Toys R Us had it, man, what was it clearance at? 65, 60 bucks, 59.99. I can't remember, maybe it's 49.99. But it's a 20 car set, and you got, um, five exclusive cars in here go ahead and uh, at the top it says the model names and it says the name of the exclusive with the word real riders words real riders right underneath it that's because each blister pack exclusive has real rider tires and uh, everything the ones underneath are just the regular release like was in the the single packs uh, they did this Sweet Rides delivery in the single packs, just like they did Slick Rides delivery, like Oil Slick, Slick Rides delivery. And uh, so anyway, th there were some variations. Somebody told me the Highway Hauler has a variation in the single pack and in this one. I haven't compared mine. I do have it in the single pack. I don't have all of these in the single pack. I picked up the uh, Dairy Delivery the highway hauler and I think the the 55 Chevy panel and maybe the fat fender I, anyway I picked up about five of the uh, singles and uh, the rest I just picked up in the set let's start with the uh, exclusives on top we got the deco delivery with the Mr. Goodbar decoration below that we got the 55 Chevy panel with Reese's pieces on there you got the Junior Mints on the 34 Ford Sedan. You got Razzles on the 57 Buick. Next exclusive, we got the Ford Co. with the Milk Duds decoration. We got, what is that, Blow Pop on the side of the Fat Fendered 40. York Peppermint Patties on the side of the Combat Medic. And then on the 40s Woody, it says it on top, but you can't really see it. It's Almond Joy. If you look at the side there, it says Almond Joy. And then there's a Tampo on the roof, but I can't really show it. On the side of the next exclusives, uh, Super Van, we have Sugar Daddy. Then below that, you can't really see it, but it says Charms on the side of the 32 Ford Sedan Delivery. 
on the side of that 56 panel it's mounds and then obviously on the side of the dairy delivery it's Tootsie Roll pops my favorite exclusive in this series the 66 a 100 Dodge is got the cool vintage looking double bubble decoration on there then below that we got the 55 Nomad with wax lips the ice cream truck with Tootsie Roll dots and then the 37 Ford Woody with Hershey's then the last exclusive is the 50 Chevy truck and it's got Twizzlers on the side there looks pretty cool with those red line rubber tires below that the funny money has a nickel nip on the side of it below that this one now I did pick this one up in the singles as well the uh, Anglia panel the crybaby on the side of there I wish you could see dude man he it's that thing on the side of the package he's totally eyes popping out and crying like crazy and then on the side of the uh, highway hauler we've got whoppers and I can't remember exactly what the guy told me. I think he said that there's a color, like maybe the uh, box is a lighter color. Maybe one of them's metal and one's plastic. I can't remember exactly. Maybe the Whopper's tampo is a little different. Or maybe the cab is a different color. Anyway, if you all know about variations in these that uh, were in the, the single cards, the singles versus the sets, uh, let me know because I don't, I don't remember all of those. Let's take a look at this whole set at once. Pretty cool set. So that's uh, that's the Sweet Rides delivery from 2010 Toys R Us. And I hope you all uh, have a good Thursday afternoon. I hope you enjoyed taking a look at Sweet Rides delivery 20 car set and the Larry Wayne and Phil's garage 30 car set and the really cool Neo Classics Teetotaler with a low production run of 3500 Tomorrow's Friday and I'm ready to start the weekend. I'm sure everybody else is too. I'll catch you then. Later.